this case. And that is Jake Patterson. So he was born on June 17th, 1997, making him 21 at the time of this case in 2018. In 2007, his parents had divorced. He graduated from Northwood High School. started 
his car so that no one would see him when he got out of his car. And he wore two pairs of gloves that night. He was questioned about what he would have done if the police had approached his vehicle that night, you know, when he pulled over so they could pass him the night of the crime. And he said that he had a shotgun and he would have used it. He was charged with two counts of first degree intentional homicide, one count of kidnapping, and one count of armed
or even to sit and have it recorded for a trial. So, how could this have been prevented? Is there a way? According to Jake's family, there were no clues. It was just a shy guy who, you know, well, he couldn't hold down a job, but there's lots of people who can't, and there's lots of people who isolate in their rooms and play video games, so doesn't have to mean that a person is going to turn out to be a killer. And even if there were some clues, you know, maybe they just didn't notice. And he had no legal history. So, you know, how could anyone have known that he was going to do this? And how about the Claus family? Was there any completely random. They didn't know this guy. There were no warning signs. Their daughter just got off a school bus like everyone else's kid and happened to be spotted by this horrible guy. So, is there anything to be learned here? Is there anything that we can take away from this? I mean, I'm struggling to find anything, really. It's just an awful, awful tragedy. Just, I mean, there, there's a bittersweet ending in that Jamie is okay, you know, physically. She managed to escape. And that's fabulous. But of course, look at what has happened to her. Her parents were murdered. She obviously suffered immensely during those days in captivity. But it sounds like she has a lot of support from her family. And I truly hope that she can heal and she can go on to live a happy life. So, 